covering the week's top tech stories with a slight Linux bias. Facebook has launched a new chatbot that it claims is able to demonstrate empathy, knowledge, and personality. Their chatbot, which they've annoyingly named Blender, was trained using available public domain conversations, which included 1.5 billion examples of human exchanges. But experts say training the artificial intelligence using a platform such as Reddit has its drawbacks. Numerous issues arose during longer conversations. Blender would sometimes respond with offensive language, and at other times it would make up facts altogether. Researchers said they hoped further models would address some of these issues. Artificial intelligence expert Dave Choppin said that Blender was a step in the right direction, but noted two fundamental issues that still need to be overcome. He told the BBC, the first is just how complex it is to replicate all of the nuances of a human attribute, like the ability to hold a, conversa a conversation, a, s a skill that most three-year-olds can master. The second is around the relationship with the data used to train the model and the results generated by the model. He goes on to explain, as great a platform as Reddit is, training algorithms based on the conversations you find there is going to get you a lot of chaff amongst the wheat. Facebook also compared Blender's performance with the latest version of Google's own chatbot, Mina. It showed people two sets of conversations, one made with Blender and the other with Mina. Conversations included a wide range of topics including movies, music and veganism. Facebook said the 67% of respondents through Blender sounded more human than Mina. The researchers noted, we achieved this milestone through a new chatbot recipe that includes improved decoding techniques, novel blending of skills, and a model with 9.4 billion parameters, which is 3.6 times more than the largest existing system. Building a truly intelligent dialogue agent that can chat like a human remains one of the largest open challenges in AI today.